This is the size of my canvas and today is my seventh day of painting this painting smaller every day. I really thought yesterday was going to be my last day but you guys wanted me to keep painting so I'm back. I also quickly realized that even my pencil lead was too thick so I decided to just go ahead and start painting. And for size comparison I'd say this one is about the size of an apple seed. the look of your room and want to switch it up? Transform your room with high quality LED lights from the LED bucket. Choose between different colors and modes to get the exact look you want. Visit the LEDbucket.com now to get your lights. Alright, here we go again, friends, except this time it's on a wood slice. Okay! And there's cacti and succulents mixed in with the flowers. We're just switching it up. We're having fun. I feel like someone commented last night, and I will tag them, but there, there's been other people I feel like... Well, hey, Batman! What you got to say? Oh, how weird. There he is right there. That was perfect timing, Bat. Um, anyways, people suggested doing cacti in my style. As always, this wood slice is on my website. There's only one. I also did a notebook 
uh, so that's fun. And then I made an art print of it so everyone can have it, as well as a foam wallpaper. So go check it out. My website is kittyscanvases.com. Okay, here comes Ella, my cat, uh, to critique this painting. Let's see what she says. Ella! Come here and tell them. Okay, thank you so much. Wow, I'd say that was pretty fair, but if anyone has a problem with what she has said, because it was bold, uh, you can contact her. All right, we're Hey guys, here's part three of me painting my fan. I decided to go with the blue butterfly idea. I thought that was really cute. So I mixed together this light blue color to do on the base. So I painted that on and I did two coats. I made sure to get the sides good and then I flipped it over and did two coats of the same blue on the other side. After that dried, I sketched on these little butterflies. I wanted to do them in different shapes and sizes and kind of space them out so they covered the whole thing. I started off with a regular blue color and just painted in the wings and then I went in with a lighter blue to add some dimension I guess and then I outlined in black the wings and then I also went back in with the same black marker and added some detailing. Um, I kind of just winged it, <laughs> get it, uh, but I just put random things that I thought would look cute, I added those dots. My quote for this one is, all we have is now, I thought that was really cute, and then I put it back in, and there it is. Let me know what you guys think, I think it's pretty cute. So I was scrolling through my For You page yesterday and I came across this guy, Sam the Sweaty Boy, who said that these super simple looking paintings were selling for hundreds of dollars, so he made his own and started the bidding at 250 Then today he said the highest bid was $13,000. Of course I thought he was lying, so I checked eBay. Turns out he was. The highest bid was $18,000. Needless to say, that was enough proof for me to get in my car and go to Michael's. I got the supplies, brought them back to my house, and started painting the canvas black and making a rig to hold the paint. I decided to do one of those pendulum paintings you see on the For You page all the time, and while it was swinging back and forth, I went on eBay and found something that looked like it belonged in Squidward's house selling for $1,800, and another one selling for $400. Now, it almost sounds too good to be true, but I finished the painting anyways and posted it on eBay with a starting bid of $251. Wish me luck. Part 4 and painting my ceiling fan. So first, I'm going to start off by doing an ombre type of thing. So I'm really trash at drawing, so I'm just drawing like a big logo, but don't worry, I'm like going to clean it up and stuff. So I did the big logo. So I did a messy black base, but I'm not done yet. I'm putting my Mod Podge and some of the black glitter did rub off, but that's okay. So this is a result. Okay, what do you think about this one? <gasps> really? <laughs> Tired of the look of your room and want to switch it up? Transform your room with high-quality LED lights from the LED Bucket. Choose between different colors and modes to get the exact look you want. Visit theledbucket.com now to get your lights.